What is up, guys and gals? Welcome back to the Nerd Castle. Sorry, I thought I, thought I saw something in this berry bush over here. I gotta be careful about it, Nerd Castle. If there's something in the berry bush, I want to make sure that I shoot it before it gnaws on me and otherwise wounds me. Welcome back to the Wasteland, everybody. My name is Splattercat. Stoked to have you here for today. And now that I've announced my presence, which I have for each and every one of you through the gift of joy, laughter, and sleep deprivation, we're going to go do a job for the Minutemen. Our gun looks like it was assembled out of some kind of, I don't know. It looks like this was made off the back page of a gun magazine or something. I don't really trust it. This thing looks like it was 3D printed by somebody with a marginal expectations for firearm. Eh, integrity, I guess would be the word that I would use right there. I don't know. Low expectations, I guess. It looks like I tried to build a gun. There, I'm just going to come out and say it. It looks like I tried to assemble a gun from scratch. So what are we up against over here? Or are we just all by our... Oh shit, there's a ghoul. Oh no, that thing is meaner than I thought it would be. Did my dog get him? Oh my god, they are going at it with my dog right now. Can they kill my dog? I don't think dog meat can be killed. I think it's a generally accepted fact. Well, is there a... Here. I will heal you, doggy, for I love you. I love you so much. Please just don't die and leave me here in the wilderness all by my lonely. I've lost my family, dude. You're all that I have left. Maybe I should go with the automatic. I feel like this one isn't bucking enough. I need to buck a little harder. And so let's make this thing happen. Pipe auto pistola. How would you like to buck freely? Yeah. Is this the same gun? There we go. Bedford Station. As in Nathan Bedford Forest, or is that just coincidental? Because. Oh no! There are explosives here. I don't think you should name shit after Nathan Bedford Forrest. It's a bad plan. It's a bad plan. So now that we're dead, that's kind of fun. I always wonder what that would be like. Turns out death is just a loading screen. Weird. Luckily, I saved right before I started the episode, so hoorah for me. Still, I think we learned a valuable lesson here today. Watch out for explosives. They appear to be all over the place over here. I'm going to hope that it's named after a different Bedford. Let's jump onto this side. I guess it probably wouldn't be named after him since it's like a middle name for him. Hey, asshole. That's right. I'm over here. Oh no, he's kind of scary. Oh shit, he's quick as hell. Damn, son. Okay. This dude got hops on him. He's got his Nikes on today. He's like that little kid. My parents used to do that. My dad would take me to get shoes when I was a little kid. And he'd be like, well, we don't know if the shoes are going to work right until you run around in them. And so then he would have me a fancy hairbrush. I don't know if I need that right now. Will you stop galloping? That is terrifying. I wish you would not. So there's the explosives right there. That took out a couple of them. I think the roamer's harder than the rest, though. Like, I think the roamers are higher level or something. Let me try out vats real quick. We can use vats at all. We put that extra point in agility, so... Ooh! Yeah, get in there, man. Get in there. I accept. Oh, you're missing so much! There's so much dirt being thrown up in the air behind that ghoul. Like, if you, were, if you were aiming for that railroad track right there, you would be having a hell of a day, but I don't think you're supposed to be aiming for... Wow, they gnawed the side off that thing, Walking Dead style. <laughs> Got in there. Got in there deep. Looks like there's still a lot of explosives over here. I'm going to err on the side of caution. Uh, looks semi-okay in here. And by that, I mean it looks like a semi drove through it. That looks lootable. I was going to say, oh my god, there is so much good shit in here. Man, what a day. Imagine a world. Imagine a world where we could all walk around together, find guns. Welcome to Robco Industries. Bedford Station loading docks, so the cargo manifests. Intake, BML, drill parts, crates, steel rebar, steel wire. Okay. wonder if they're going to send me back over here to get that later. 
October 23rd, lots of fastenings, spools of electrical wire. Be pretty useful if you've been in this situation. Trying to rebuild cities and whatnot. There's a Nuka-Cola bottle on the ground. Unfortunately, it's already been sucked freely. Wonder glue. Close that door real fast. Are they hiding anything back here? I've noticed that their placement has been quite a bit sneakier in this game than it normally is. And so, I actually, I think really Bethesda stepped up their game with this title. They sincerely did. I feel like almost everything in the game is better. I'm still not totally sold. I'm not totally sold on the conversation wheel, but the voice acting and the storytelling is so much better. Like, one of the longest... Wow, that did not kill you? Oh, shit balls! You guys are, like, everywhere. This is a principal concern for me right now. Oh, he's coming in low. Yeah! You want to come in at me? I got you, son! I know what cures a zombie invasion. I'm ready to go. Chew on that ankle, dog meat! Get in there! Get yourself some jerky. Take something home. Put it in a doggy bag. <laughs> Dog's like, I hate that joke. That's the worst joke. I don't know why they call it a doggy bag. Does anybody normally bring home their leftovers for their dog? I bring home leftovers for me. I ain't rich. <laughs> Dog's gonna have to eat kibble for a little while. <laughs> uh, this direction seems like a really bad idea. We are fighting our way through a serious infestation right now. I mean, we still got... God, you can carry so much stuff. I appreciate that as a pack rat. I really do. A tempered raider left leg. Oh, that's way better. How come I'm not using that one? Sweet. And then I needed aid. And I think I'm about to eat something that's probably not good for me right now. Like a couple of blood leaves or something. Carrot flour will work too, although our rads are getting a little high. Still, let's clear this train dock out. It's on the way to where we're going, so I feel like it'd be a waste if we didn't. Oh shit, there's another one of you over here. Damn, you guys are stacked. The sheer HP on these little pricks. Beating on my dog like you don't know better. Yeah, I think we're about to lose dog meat in just a second. Did that get both of them with... Yeah, there it is. That's why I like the boomstick rat mole rat teeth. The hell do I need those for? Wow, the ghouls look a lot different too. Huh. Oh, sorry, buddy. Wait, are you up and running again? All right, if you're up and running, then I'm not going to waste a stim pack. That one appears to be dead, too, and it's a roamer, which is one of the nastier ones. On top of those, they got the glowing ones or the bright ones or whatever the hell they're called. And then I think there's another one, too. Dutchman's Instructions, the dead guy over here. Surveyor's Outfit. After having surveyed the surveyor's outfit, I don't think I want to look like a podunk. And so up the stairs, we got to be dressed well in the apocalypse, man. If you ain't looking good, what's the point? What is the point? The station master's terminal. A folder. We got a used oil can, an extinguisher. What's going on right here? Critical failure in the track switching system has been detected. Please clear the tracks. It's half past. Late. No, something's wrong. Someone's coming. Look, five of them. It's a trap. Damn it, they've got us surrounded. What do we do? Uh, I'll draw them off. Give me a count of ten, then uh, break for the tree line. What? Dutchman, I... There's no time. Good luck, A9. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. No! No! No. I'm not going back. I can't. I won't. So where's the other dead dude at? Looks like I can turn on a spotlight or something. That seems like a dumb idea, though. Let's see, units connect, you activate them? I don't know. What's that gonna do for me? Spotlight's activated, okay. 
Where are them spotlights at? Let me see. That's pretty amazing if after 200 years, both the machinery and the spotlights, they must build stuff like it was built back in the 50s. I mean, aside from building their society. It looks like they spent, I mean, old stuff is built well. I hate to be one of those people, but like, the quality and craftsmanship that went into old stuff. Tell you what, it was just a cut beyond everything nowadays, mass producing breaks after like five minutes. You can still get quality products, but you're going to pay for them, whereas back in the day, reasonably cheap and they last forever. What's going on over here with this pileup? Nothing? Looks pretty empty to me. Let's keep going towards our objective. I said we were going to accomplish it today, and by Jove, I don't know why I'm invoking the name of Jove right now. Who named their kid Jove? Is that still a real name? I don't think I've ever met somebody named Jove. I grew up in a religious family among like a real, like a very, very real sort of commune of super religious people. What'd you find? Oh, you probably found something. Man, stop finding obvious stuff. I could find this. You gotta find the hearts. What is that X right there? Oh, those are the bottoms of Nuka Cola bottles. Gotcha. Cap stash on that side, just in case you needed some cash. Some Skrillzes, some Guap, some Guapamole. You just need that cheddar, that Gouda, that Cotija. Looks like we got a car park or something down there. I feel like a lot of the areas are far more condensed than they were in previous games, though. Like, I really feel like the little areas are, like, very, very close. Like, you wander from one landmark to the next really easily. It's a manic... God, that's scary. What's up with all the mannequins around here? Anytime I'm in the wasteland, I told you guys my mannequin story. No way I could pick this. Looks like they left that poor bastard in there with some rat away. Some supplies in there. I don't know if you can go up and over the top, maybe. But I can't really get in there, so I'm not going to worry about it for right now. I also hear... I'm gonna break these radios. Shut up, radios. Stop trying to get me copyright claimed. Some gum drops. I don't know what we need those. Oh, Christ! Run! Oh, shit, run! Oh, don't stand your ground and fight, dude! Don't do that! Luckily, it appears to be stuck. Here, give me the 10. I need bigger and better DACA. And just deep down, I'm going to hope that it doesn't come unbugged. Or we are hosed. That thing hit me so hard. Also, we are leeching radiation everywhere. So my next suggestion would be... Oh my god, we ain't got nothing left, do we? Got no bullets. Got no love. Oh, man. Well, that's not good. Pipe rifle. You got anything? Nope. Pipe rifle ain't got nothing. Oh, you're going to make me do this, aren't you? I'll save you, dog meat. Hold still. Back up off my dog, red scorpion. I think we might need to run. I think it might be bail time. Let's go ahead and bail. Oh, shit, dog meat. Okay, come here, bro. Get over here. Yikes. That ate up a lot of bullets. That was not a smart expenditure. That has left me in a very real situation where we might not have the supplies we need in order to get this done properly. I think there's another one over there. I heard it. What's going on on this side? It appears as though... This lumber car has been stopped mid-track. Pointing out the obvious. It's the easiest way to YouTube. I think I'll go and I think we need to use some Rataway like right now. And if we don't... 
I'm gonna eat the food first. And then I'm gonna go right away real quick. And I think that should deplete. There we go. Looking better. Looking a bit more spiffy. Got a dog on that side that I'm not positive we're prepared to deal with. Might want to check the little the little tunnel down here too. Kind of hard up for supplies right now. We could use just about anything. Oh shit. Is that a Yaogwai? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, there's a Yaogwai. Running away. Hell no, Yaogwai. A stunted Yaogwai. Yeah, he ain't that stunted. Hate to tell you. So what does the little skull mean? Does it mean he's like heroic or something? Guarding this bridge like a troll. Where's my dog at? Fuzzy little wannabe Winnie the Pooh looking bastard. Oh, I think he's still on me. I'm gonna try and lose him, but Wasteland's kind of dangerous. Bad things happening right now. Some cows over here. Got some Brahmin. That's fine. I can be detected. Just don't attack me. Yeah, that Yaogwa is down there camping. I don't know how the hell we're going to get dog meat out of that. It's going to take some doing. I don't think we have the firepower in any situation to take care of that Yaogwa. So getting rid of him might be a little troublesome. I mean, all that I've really got is like grenades and other little things that I can throw at him and hopefully it'll blow up closely enough to where it'll take him out. But aside from that, hell if I know. I... Oh, shit. Okay. Just trying to make for the radio. I don't see anything else on the floor, do you? Christ. Nothing over here to rescue a dog with, either. A couple of cigarette cartons, but that's about it. I don't know what to say right now. We may have to come back for him. There's a mannequin out there. Oh, this is all manner of creepy. I don't like this for a second. Yikes. Is there a way up on the roof? I think that Yaogwa is like an emplacement, like it's just there. The problem I'm running into is, let's say I sneak in and get the dog. The dog's just going to attack him again. After I give him the, after I give him the medicine, he's just going to attack the Yaogwa again. I didn't expect to see a Yaogwa this early in the game. Frankly, though, I mean, after the Death Claw, it's like, well, what could possibly be next? We could bring the Power Suit back. That's all that I could think of. We could go snatch up that Power Suit. Or we could go snatch up the Power Armor that's up there and bring the Minigun back and see if we can get rid of it. Save our dog. How far away was that? Not like super far, but far enough.
Well, let's go have a look. If this doesn't end up working, then I guess I'll just cry myself to sleep. But we got like 600 rounds on a minigun and a fully functional suit of power armor. Oh, you can just fast travel the dog out? Oh, well, shit. There goes that. I kind of want to kill that Yagoi based on principle now, though. I don't like it when things beat me up. Not in general. It kind of upsets me. Things make me look like a punk. I tend to get a little bit of a black eye and a bad attitude. Still, we gotta find some place to resupply. That's the other thing we're running into. I need to go buy like a hundred rounds for each gun because unfortunately that rad scorpion tapped me out. You're not talking your way out of this. Please, you gotta help me. This guy's a synth and he, he's gonna kill me and replace me and my family. Oh God, my kids. Don't you dare bring them up. He's the synth and he wants to replace me. Please, please, you gotta believe me. You can't let that thing. Kinda confused right now. I'm not seeing any indicative things to lead me in one direction or another. 650 HP, oh my God. It's amazing. Still, I think I'm gonna stick with the purified water. Do this. Let's all just calm down. No one has to die. No, he wants me dead. He's never gonna stop. I have to kill him. Don't listen to him. It'll say anything to convince you. Look, all I need is for you to put down the gun. Then we can talk this through. I... All right. I'm putting the gun away. Oh, thank God. Now I just have to dig two graves. If that's what you want. Art appears to be kind of badass. Oh, dude, I'm not even reloaded. There you go, dog meat. Get him, dog meat. that stim pack oh you didn't reload okay I gotta wait for the reload Christ so what's a synth component do hey where'd you run off to man hey I saved your life dude you better come back here and reward me you know altruism out here. Maybe you should do a better job at not attracting psychotic robots. You ever think about that? Like, how does this even happen? Like, what deity did you taunt to make this come out of the woodwork? Clearly you taunted somebody. A rat away? I don't really need that. I could use the rat away, but everything else doesn't look that appetizing. I think this is the place where, I don't know, I got a bunch of stuff done over here. What's on this side? And what is it leading me towards? Let's find out. Oh, it's leading me back over there. Okay, well then. Instead of doing that... I think we might need to pick the Bones of Conquered a little bit more and see if we can get some more bullets. Kind of tapped out right now. That gun looks pretty sick. I also like the reticle. It makes me happy. It feels it makes me feel like I've prestiged a couple of times. So I'm going to suggest that while we're here we burgle like the wind. Being as this is an American household, one can assume we'll probably find at least a couple dozen rounds here, right? I mean, I don't know. I grew up around guns. Everybody had guns. Everybody had bullets around their house and stuff. I don't like laying around, but welding goggles, bobby pin, advanced safe. Let me see what I can. Ah, ah, so close, so close, so close, but so far away. There we go. That's exactly what I needed. That is like precisely what I was looking for. Now that we got all that stuff, 
Don't really need the silver tablespoon. Not worried about that. We got some more drugs over on this side. Man, everybody got drugs. What happens if I sleep for a couple hours? Does it heal me? I hope it does because we've had a rough day. And it's almost Halloween. I guess we heal super fast, so that's good. I've got like one reload from both of these. Let's go see if we can't dig up some ammo from the outskirts of town that I may not have grabbed on the way through. Alien spaceship over there. Toolbox over here with duct tape and fuses. Cram sounds delicious, but not now. Not now. There's no time. Insta mash. Cap stash. That'd be great if I'd found a place to buy anything at yet. A red dress. Just what I always wanted. Why does everybody have these safes? Like, I don't think I've ever met anybody that had a safe in their house unless it was for guns. Definitely know people with gun safes, but aside from that, hmm. How much was the fancy hairbrush worth, by the way? Nine. Eh. I know I can break down some of this stuff for component parts, but I'm not super interested in it right now. Ain't no way to go up and in over there. I just like to get like three reloads for each gun before we go any further out. Our gun does not appear to be affecting anything, though. Like, we have put a lot of rounds on some of the enemies. And it feels like it's to no avail. I may focus a little bit more heavily on skills that give us higher damage, possibly. Seems like an okay plan. I've been inside the workhouse. I ain't going back in there. Every time I go in, they try to make me work. Sorry. I'm not built for that. I am not built for that sort of labor. Ain't nothing over here. Looks like this house might not have been picked through yet, though. Medics and buff out. Pork and beans, bobby pin box. You know what? I'm going to take the food because every now and again I just need healy stuff to get things done with. Ooh, hey, we got a dead guy up here. A bolt action sniper rifle. Shit, they're building everything out of pipes out here. You give them a pipe, they'll come back with a gun, won't they? A gas mask with goggles, left arm. No thank you. Another safe on the wall. Let's get ourselves some free BXP, shall we? There it is. Perfect. Nice. Alright, so now that I'm feeling better about our prospects, feeling like a motorcycle club, good about our prospects, I think, how much do I have for the 10? So I got about three reloads, which is what I was looking for. Got another dog over here. Some storage units. Couple of dead guys, razor grain, silver bowl, why not? Is the athletic like Hold on, is the athletic is the athletic suit like an underlayer? I think it must be. So these guys like running a marathon out here? That dog had a teddy bear. I don't wanna shoot it, I feel bad. I'm gonna feel like a giant asshole. That door just opened on its own? That's kinda creepy. Me no likey. Yeah, we definitely gotta ramp up our damage. We are just not hitting things hard enough. There's a rad scorpion over there, too. I think it's pretty clear what happened. Rad scorpion rolled into town and wiped everybody the hell on out. Good for me, bad for them, considering how hard up I am for ammunition right now. Well, shit. Rad scorpion meats and stingers. I'll probably take the stinger just in case. I think we need to find ourselves a place to resupply. Sell something to somebody and make ourselves some caps and get ourselves some ammo for the long term. I'm going to think about it and stare at the map for a minute. My name is Splattercat. Thank you for joining me here at the Nerdcast for the next episode of Fallout 4. I will see you all in the next episode. Hi, do everybody.